Welcome back to Stuff We Love. Today we're talking about Peel Tech liquid masking system. What, what is this, yeah, Josh? You've got this stuff applied. It's a protective product that's like a liquid tape. This is some of the coolest stuff I've gotten to play with. I've never seen anything like I know. this So Peel Tech is actually a newer company. They've only been around for about a year. I mean, they've been in development, but this stuff is starting to come around now. Um, this product, you use it for protecting areas like your bathtubs, your door sills if you're doing construction. Now, don't get me wrong, this isn't just a pro product, it's a DIY as well. If you're setting tile backsplash, you could paint this on the countertop mm -hmm. with a brush. It, you can roll it or brush it. You'd brush it on, it would dry, you would set anything you drop or do anything, um, then you remove it, remove it afterwards and it, it it leaves no well, residue, it looks like new. That's what the peel part is, right? It just yeah. peels off like tape. Yeah, the peel tech part of it. So, so you've this got is, this is it's not liquid, it's more like a, what would you call this? Like you like saw a, me. That's like a goo? Hey, yeah, putting well, it here, on. Let's, let's peel it off. So it hold, what's really cool if you notice with Will is it holds to the contour, so really nice and tight, and as he pulls it off, I mean, this is chair rail. I mean, it's it pulls right off. Yeah. Like so nothing. if you you were doing had some really intricate stuff that you're painting around, you could you could uh, put this on first yeah. and then just peel it right off. It doesn't leave any residue. Yeah. If you're outside doing stone, you got the driveway there or concrete, and you're setting stone up, you could put some in front, let it dry for a couple hours, or I can't. Or oh, yeah, that would be perfect because yes. you don't want to use masking tape outside. No. Even that exterior stuff doesn't work super well. Exactly. Yeah. Or if you're doing stone in a house and you got ram board down or uh, hardboard, you want to seal that edge so the grout doesn't get underneath and you're stepping on your hardwood right. floors and crushing it in, scratching it. This stuff is really, really neat. So here's a piece of wood we got it on. So you just rub your hand. It's almost like a rubber. Yeah. And then you get that's it going. Like, that's like a finished, pulls right off. a finished wood. Isn't that cool? So here's a piece of porcelain. You can use this in the bathroom to pull up, but that's. I mean, this stuff is neat. Oh, I've cool. never seen anything like this stuff. Here's some tile we did. It pulls off of here as well, so this is, it's really cool. Here, and here's brick. So, in porous is very, or brick is very, very porous. So yeah. you know that it yeah. should stick it on there. Yeah, it pulls right off. Pulls right up. So, you can buy these syringes as well. That's really cool. So, they Why got would really, you want well, these they got really like tight this. tips if you gotta do really, Petite, intricate stuff, you okay. know what I mean? Um, you can use these as well. And now it comes in a quart. You can get the one gallon, mm -hmm. or they got a three and a half gallon. So um, I'd say one quart does a bathtub. Okay. So if you're gonna do the bathtub, well, what's so you the don't cost for a quart? So there's a quart, a gallon, and a three and a half gallon. Starting, you're gonna pay around 20 bucks for a quart. A gallon's about $70, and it's $230 approximately for the three and a half gallons. But that's gonna go a long, long way. Yeah, I mean, if that's, you protect yeah, your yeah. Whole house. It's, yeah. <laughs> I recommend highly to always check the area before you're putting yeah, it on to make wanna, sure. With stuff like this, um, you always yeah. want to test it on a small exactly. area. Exactly. Well, but this, I, this is really, really cool. cool. This is yeah. cool stuff. Peel Tech Temporary Protective Surface Coating. Um, you can check them out at peeltech.com. Really, really neat. Stay tuned for more stuff we love. Isn't that cool, dude? You know, I could peel this stuff all Look day. Whoa. Whoa! Hey!